Hey love, so today I have a what's in my purse video. This has been highly requested for a while. I did one for the summer and now I'm doing a fall edition. And I got requests because my husband's amazing and I got a brand new Michael Kors bag. So, and yes, it is, this is going to be a true what's in my purse. I do not go through my purse before I film. In my last one, my summer one, my purse was actually very organized and that's not like me and it was smaller but as you can see this is your girl's type of bag this thing probably weighs more like half of my body weight did you just hear that seriously it is heavy as crap you could knock somebody out with it let's just jump in i'm gonna stop rambling so hope you guys enjoy okay pretty so i am in a hotel i don't know if it's obby or not but i am so i apologize for the lighting this is the best i could do um i am sitting near a very well lit window but um it's kind of early in the morning this is my bag that i've been carrying very open it's like a shopper type tote i'm not sure what the exact model number or name of it is it's got the little gold feet on the bottom top has a snap right here and then yeah you guys look at this oh my gosh i'm so embarrassed okay so and you can put the snaps down so the bag it makes the bag even more open yeah, let's uh, <laughs> see what's in my purse because clearly it's pretty much everything I own. This is going to be probably a tad bit unconventional and maybe you've probably never seen a What's My Purse film this way before, but welcome to 5TV, y'all. So, first thing that is like grabbing my eye, last night um, made a trip to Walgreens. I got some baby lips of their winter edition. They, What I saw were four different ones and got spiced it up, which I've already used and then Coca Rush. So that was in there. <laughs> and I guess I'll go and throw that bag away. We're out of town right now. Um, so I had to get ready in the car. So I've got a lot more things in here that I normally would not have. Um, an entire bottle of Twisted Peppermint from Bath and Body Works. So next we have, make sure that my license is hidden. Yes, well, well okay, we'll look at sunglasses next. Be from the Family Dollar. Oh, yes, indeed. Spent a whopping four bucks on these so yeah they're super fancy i actually love them they're a really good shape got my new little wallet one of those iphone wallets i've got an iphone 6s now and so it fits perfectly down in here here's where my license would be and this is actually my room key for the hotel this was only five dollars from dollar general by the way i always have like an emergency or essentials bag in my purse so it says sparkle and it's from bath and body works and their um black friday special thing bag thing from last year. I always carry like an eye brightener. Well, I have switched to this one by Chella and this is their ivory lace highlighter and oh my gosh, you guys, this blows my Revlon out of the water. It is absolutely amazing. This is my new go-to. This is always with me. I use this every single day. I'll just I'll swatch it for you guys. Just absolutely in love with it. I have a little body spray. This is the Cotton Candy by Body Fantasies. Um, a little extra hand lotion that came from Birchbox. Some oil blotting sheets. A few extra um, like ibuprofen and things. Um, a couple of hair ties. Dollar Tree Tied knockoff pin for just in case stains because you know you girls clumsy as crap. So next I have this little pocket back from last year from Bath and Body Works. I'm trying to uh, use up. I'm so sad that they have the new ones out now because I have used this little holder for a long time now. I love this thing. Um, my, okay, let's see what these are. I have a coupon for Nexium for $2. Oh, honey, do you want to keep this? It's a receipt for Wrigley's vet visit. Um, thank you guys so much for all the well wishes and prayers for my little baby boy. So I've got my coach wallet in here and this is just temporary. I have this at the last second because I need to switch everything I need over to this uh, wallet because this is going to be my primary wallet. A little Dollar Tree cloth that works for my phone, my iPad if it's with me, my eyeglasses and it's like superhero words. It like makes me happy every time I see it. Got my eyeglasses. One lonely leave pill to remind myself I need some more. So that's in there. So I've got my hairbrush and this is one of the detangler brushes from Dollar Tree. Yeah, it's amazeball. I used my big sexy hair uh, push up volume. This is instant volume and just can we just take a minute? How precious is this? I love big sexy hair products and this stuff works like 
I can't even. It's a thickening finishing spray. Finishing sprays, if you get the right one, it's gonna hold, but you're gonna be able to brush, you know, use your brush and brush through it, and it's still gonna make your hair stay in place. But this one is all that in a bag of chips because it's also volumizing, and it is just amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. I love this stuff. Well, yeah, I did have that in there because I was in dire need of that today. I've got these random Altoids I've not eaten yet. These came from my Beautycon BFF box. And speaking of that, I'll go ahead and grab this. I had to do my makeup in the car, and I realized um, that this is the perfect size for my makeup brushes. Um, but these are the makeup brushes I have with me. I'll, I'll show you a few. Like, I've got Sonia fan brush, just a couple of generic ones, uh, Bare Minerals, Real Techniques brush. This, okay, this is their blush brush. Most amazing blush brush I have ever used in my life. It is literally effortless magic because it knows exactly where to put the blush on your face. All you have to do is literally hold this up to your face and move it around on your cheek area. And it's just amazing and it's super heavy and it's pink and they've always got these grippy handles at the end. Thanks to BeautyCon, this isn't sponsored further, but I got to try this Real Techniques fine liner brush and I had already been trying this one out and I'm just so impressed by these brushes. This is the best, like my favorite brush in the entire world right now. That one and my Sonia brush from Target. Number 129, baby, 129. Another Ricola drop. Peppermint from Sonic. <laughs> no, I haven't been to Sonic and got a large peanut butter fudge milkshake. I've not done that recently, no. Mm -mm. That's not happened at all. A lonely bobby pin. Seems like a staple in everybody's bag. There's always the bobby pins. <laughs> Is that it? No gum wrappers? And did I really get off that easy this time? Really? Well, actually, no, I've got a part of a gum wrapper. So the last thing down in the bag is my makeup. I'll show you guys like a few things that are in here, but like, um, oh, a subby sitting in this, I'm obsessed. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. What can I show you in here that I'm loving recently? I'm really loving this baby skin uh, blush recently. Um, it's instant cheek flush. This is what I'm using currently, um, like when I do darker lips for the fall. Um, it's just LA Colors, you can get the Dollar Tree. This is my Maybelline Eye Studio. Uh, yep, got that big lots and olive martini. Also for the lazy days, I can't live without my julep. Then I cannot live without my don't leave your brows at home, obviously, because I can't leave my brows at home. Love this stuff. Little baby benefit, they're real. My HD under eye setting powder from Elf Studio. I've got my instant age rewind by Maybelline. What else? Oh, I've got my one of my baby lips glosses in here. I've got Coral craze in here. Has ever wondered what I bring on a trip for makeup and you know brushes? There you go. I've got my Hello Kitty mints that I got at Five Below. Well, they're not mints; they're actually just little pieces of candy, but little mustache candies, and I love them. And I reach for them more often than not. And you can't even tell I've made a dent in this little notepad. This is what I write my lists on for the store. Subby sent me this, and I really love it. Well, of course, I've got gum. You guys know I'm addicted to chewing gum. I've got some extra pumpkin spice in here at the moment. Normally, it would be polar ice. I've got this pair of earrings I've not opened yet, which, um, like I said, you know, I was grabbing a lot of stuff last minute when we were running out the door. This is like my favorite. I've been wearing this nonstop. My Revlon Just Bitten Kissable Balm Stain. And this is in the color Darling. And it's gorgeous, darling, gorgeous. Look at that. Ooh, I love it. I've been wearing it literally every day. It's minty too. And it stays forever. It's just, oh my gosh, it's amazing balls. I have my Blossom Gloss. My friend April got me this. And this came from Urban Outfitters. I've actually, speaking of April, I visited her the other day and she gave me a Leapy. And this is a new one, it's by Heart Candy. I don't even like used it yet, but I brought it with me. Look at the packaging though, but it's Gorge. She said I knew it was a you color and it's definitely a me color. And this is in the shade Provocative. Oh my, I'm surprised that I don't have another baby lips in here. This is kind of weird. Normally I have just like a plain baby lips. Hmm. Um, but I've got my lipstick holder and right now I've got MAC in here. Yes, this is Rebel. The little lipstick case came from Shop Miss A. Uh, this is just my powder that I'm using right now. Wet and Wild Natural Blend. And then I have a pack of Kleenex, of course. Here we go. Here's the baby lips. I know. I can tell. 
Yes, sir. Okay. So I think this is like one of the newer ones or if not, I don't know. This one is um, one of the ones that has SPF 20 in it and it's just the peppermint one. It's number 10. That's always a must to have with me something like that, but I'm loving that one recently. And then I have a little hand cream. This is by Skin Fix and uh, that actually came with my Beauty Con stuff too and I've been loving it. Perfect because my hands are starting to get super dry. Okay, I'm known to have food in my purse but <laughs> a couple more things in here for sustenance than, than usual because um, I've, you know, it, we had a long car ride. I've got a caramel almond sea salt kind bar, a maple pumpkin seed with sea salt. It's like a, a Chewy Crunchy Granola Bar from Kind. Honey Badger Hydration Recovery. That came out of my Super Gains pack. And I actually really love this stuff. These Colgate Wisp Max Fresh things. I picked up the little four pack at Dollar Tree. And I am going to buy like one of the bigger ones at Target or Walmart or somewhere. Because I love these. And then I've also got, um, this is actually should be in my travel bag. Like my other beauty bag. Um, but I've got my flossers in here. Just little placards. From Dollar Tree, but those need to go elsewhere. I always carry my little mustache coin purse thing, and just down in here, I have an extra USB uh, for my phone, and then just an extra um, car charger. And the little mustache case is also from the Dollar Tree. So that's what was in my bag. Like I said, I, I'm keeping it super real with y'all. I'm surprised I didn't have like more trash and stuff. Um, you know. I, I'm actually kind of proud of myself. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.